Your monitor shutting off in the middle of work or gaming is the worst, right? It feels like it's playing a cruel game with you on, off, on, off. Don't worry. Today, we're going to solve that problem step by step and get your monitor stable again. 1. Check cables and power connections. You should always start with the basics. Double check your power and video cables. A loose connection might be the only thing causing your monitor to switch off randomly. Make sure everything is plugged in tightly at both ends. Look for signs of wear or damage on your cables. If they seem frayed, swap them with new ones and see if the problem goes away. 2. Update your graphics drivers. Next up, your graphics drivers. Outdated drivers are a sneaky cause behind this kind of issue. Head over to the official website for your graphics card, whether it's NVIDIA, AMD, or Intel and download the latest version. Or you can update them through the device manager on Windows. Keeping drivers up to date improves performance and prevents weird problems like these. 3. Disable sleep mode and screen saver. If your monitor randomly goes off even when the cables and drivers are fine, it could be a settings issue. Disable the screen saver and adjust your sleep mode settings. Sometimes these features are triggered too quickly, turning off your monitor when you don't expect it. Go into your power settings and either turn these off or extend the timer. 4. Overheating problems. Overheating is another common reason your monitor might shut down. Make sure it's placed in a spot with good ventilation. Check the vents for dust buildup, give them a quick clean with compressed air if needed. Also, try lowering the brightness to generate less heat. If the problem persists, consider using a monitor stand with built-in fans. 5. Scan for malware. Believe it or not, malware can also cause your monitor to act weird. Do a full system scan with updated antivirus software. If your antivirus finds something, make sure to clean it up and check if the monitor stays stable afterward. 6. Test the monitor on another device. Here's a quick way to figure out if the issue lies with the monitor or your computer. Try connecting the monitor to another device, like a different PC or a laptop. If the problem follows the monitor, it might need repairs. But if it works fine, the issue could be with your computer's hardware or graphics card. Finally, if you've tried everything and the problem isn't fixed, don't give up just yet. Reach out to the manufacturer's support team. They'll know if this is a common issue with your model and can offer additional solutions. If your monitor is still under warranty, they might even repair or replace it.